All right, so it's currently 3 p.m. right now. Dev and I are both at our hotel room because we are out in LA. We've been here for about a week now. Haven't really done any filming for YouTube yet, but I'm filming a video today, and it is actually our 21st birthday, and I'm about to go for a 6.05 deadlift PR. So yesterday I drank almost like two gallons of water, just been eating a ton of food. I woke up at like noon today, went straight to IHOP, got some French toast and shit, and I just had some cookies and milk, so I should be feeling super full. About to take a ton of pre-workout and everything. I'm gonna show you guys what I'm taking. So hopefully when I get in there, I feel extremely good and can pull, finally, a 600 pound deadlift. So yeah, we're getting everything packed up. Devin might go for something heavy. But yeah, I guess we'll, we'll see. see. I'll see how I feel warming up and decide if I want to pull something big. But I'm like, yeah, because we're supposed so to have, we're supposed to have like an RP what like RP seven like six, or something yeah. six. But our training's single. been so shit the last week that yeah. it's kind of just like whatever if we go off program. Yeah. And Devin actually hit a four fifty five high bar squat yeah. the other day. Four fifty five high bar squat potentially six oh five conventional deadlift today. Making them honest. And then maybe a three fifteen comp bench. Alright, so what's gonna week. be the pre stack? I'll do two uh, and I've been taking like a smaller amount of pre this week. So I'm gonna do two full scoops of euphoria which I basically never do and then Let's take some, some of this stuff right some here. fat burner with one three in it. Yeah, I'll do a scoop and a half. Yeah. Cause I don't want to do like 500 milligrams of caffeine. <laughs> what the fuck? fuck? I also got two stitches in my finger. It's like I sliced it like right on the edge. So I don't even know if I'm gonna be able to deadlift hundred percent. I'm still hoping I can like grip the bar. So we're just gonna see what happens when I'm warming up but hopefully the 605 will still go down, so let's see. I also have some Alpha GPC here. Gonna take that, hopefully make us all strong and shit. How much should I do? Just put a decent amount on your finger. Like that? No, take more than that. Like yeah, that. do that, take that. Is that like a fuckload? Just take it, dude. Some Alpha GPC. All right, let me take some too. Real strong. All right, so we got the scoop and a half euphoria right here. I'm just gonna down this right now because it's like a 20 minute drive to the gym. So I'll have everything kick in and be feeling real nice by the time we get there. Yeah, normally I take my pre with just like a minuscule amount of water. So it doesn't taste very good, but I've been taking the euphoria pineapple mango with like a lot more water now. And it honestly tastes like actually so good. It's probably the best pre, best tasting pre I've ever had. Who's connected to you? Play some gas shit. When I usually take a bunch of pre-workout stimulants and like one, three, all that, I feel like super nervous and like jittery and weird. And I feel that a little bit right now, but it's like a perfect amount where I'm like super hyped, feel focused. I feel good. I didn't take too much stuff because in the past I've definitely taken like too many stimulants where it's actually fucked me up, but I feel really good right now. And I think the 605 is going to get locked out. Today's the day, 21 years old and we're about to deadlift 600 fucking pounds, so let's go in and let's get it. Brand new. Thanks, man. Yeah, when you guys are done, just leave it on the floor. All right, okay. Don't lane it up. All right, yeah. All 
All right, I'm just gonna do a few stretches, like warm up my back and stuff, and then we're gonna hop into the deadlift session. We got the Texas deadlift bar out, brand new. So yeah, let's get it. I just pulled that 605 pretty clean. I honestly probably could have repped it because my second rep usually moves a little bit nicer. And I am so happy right now. Like, that's been a long time in the making. I've just had so many setbacks, so many little injuries. And I finally just pulled a clean 605 deadlift, 20 pound PR. So happy right now. Like, literally couldn't ask for anything more. So, let's fucking go probably gonna do some super light back off sets like not kill myself but get some volume in So I just did one back off set with 455 and I'm pretty fried so I just called it there and we actually have bench programmed in. So I'm about to go over to the incline bench, start warming up on that and I think we basically have like a full push day rest of this workout, get a pretty good pump. Two twenty-five for ten on incline, all-time PR. Form was fucking shitty, but after two sets of five to two forty-five, that's still crazy. I've never done that for more than five on incline. That just goes to show what like getting your body weight up will yeah. do to your bench. My deadlift, like my knee was hurting, could barely pull over five hundred. My bench is just insane. Absolutely today. skyrocketing.
under the bright sky Only sunshine Under the bright sky When the words are like bullets And they break through your skin And there's no way to get them all out When it feels like rust sipping into your soul Stay gold, gold, gold Stay gold, gold, gold Stay gold, gold, gold Under the bright sky So we just finished up that workout and I'm actually filming on my iPhone right now because the camera SD card filled up, ran out of storage and we're about to go get food somewhere, not 100% sure yet. And I don't even know if we're gonna go out tonight even though it's our 21st birthday. We don't really have any plans right now and I'm, I honestly just wanted to pull that 605 today and that's what I'm like really hyped on but we'll probably go out to dinner or do something. So how does it feel to be 21? Same as yesterday and the day before. Holy shit. Where are we going to get food? Probably like sweet green. Oh yeah, let's eat sweet green. I want something healthy. All right, let's go. Let's because I literally let's ate go. IHOP and cookies and milk today. So, gonna go put down some sweet green. Buffalo chicken bowl with double chicken. Yeah, we, oh, I've said that in my video in New York. Street. Like we literally only get the buffalo chicken bowl at sweet green, so let's end it. All right, we just got the sweet green signature buffalo chicken bowl. I actually got double chicken for the first time. How's it tasting? It's good. Put yeah. it down. Let's get it. 